everybody. It's Poon at Poomcast.com. We are here at Chicago Comic Con 2009, and it's not about just comics anymore. One of my favorite parts is all the little toys that you can get. Come on, let's go check it out. Yes. Batman, World of Warcraft, my fave. I'm always a World of Warcraft guy. Let's go, let's go see Awesome. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Oh, did you check out my check out my snapper reference? Please, friend. Toys. Please. Hi, I'm here with Brian with Imperial Quartermaster out of North Carolina. Uh, tell us, what are some of your more popular items? Right now, uh, G.I. Joe's, Transformers, uh, as far as action figures go, anything horror related as well. Now, are there any like obscure kind of B horror movies that you know that they just happen to make figurines, but they only made, they didn't make a lot of them? Like as compared to like Texas Chainsaw, there's like. Uh, like uh, Puppet Master from the 90s, uh, the little puppets. They made a lot of action figures for those. Killer Clowns from Outer Space. And, the, you know, those figures run 50, 75 bucks a pop if you can find them. Um, just, you wouldn't think would be expensive figures, but, you know, they're tough to find. Oh. Oh. Oh, dark Crystal. Okay, okay, there's a Dark Crystal figure, and I gotta go see it. Please, friend. Legend. Awesome. Let's keep looking. When working in the sun, use protective eyewear. <laughs> we are at the Toy Cave uh, from Carlisle, Pennsylvania. Um, it looks like they have a lot of very old figurines and different toys. Uh, plush Star Wars. That's kind of fun. Uh, looks like we have some... Oh! Uh, old Transformers. Check that out. Castle Grayskull. I had one until one of my dogs peed on it. Turned the face all black because it tarnished the paint. Original Tatooine, 375, still in the box. Beautiful. Beautiful. Why, why, Rainfar? Why? It's okay. It's okay. I'm really enjoying Comic Con this year. I'm uh, really hoping to uh, speak with some celebrities. Ooh, still in the box. Although, Kind of chattered, but still, it looks good. I'm here with uh, Craig with uh, Custom Built Arcades. Uh, tell us a little bit what about what you're doing here. Well, we have uh, actually uh, custom built arcade machines that uh, play 10,000 games. Uh, we custom build them whether you want a two player unit, four player unit. Uh, we're currently working on one guy who's actually uh, redoing his basement and he's having us build it into his bar and he's got the projection up, up behind it. So, you name it, we can build it. I used to hang out in arcades all the time, and this came out at the end of, of the summer. Oh, now I'm remembering. So those were a few of the things that I really liked. Uh, my favorite, of course, the Dark Crystal. Wish they had more figurines, but uh, I can't remember. I can't remember their names. But the the, the please friend. I want a couple of figurines just to kind of play the dinner scene together. But uh, I think I'm gonna, actually going to go get that one. So. <laughs> so that was some of the uh, fun things. I'm hearing myself. That were some of the fun things that uh, um, that I found here. Um, I do want the dark crystal figurines, and they have two of them. Um, but they didn't look like they had like the little the little forks on the figures from Dark Crystal, where they're sitting there eating with their little little knife and fork with their fingers. Uh, if they have that, I probably will definitely get it. Uh, you should come on down. There's a lot of good stuff here. I'm not too much of a comic geek, actually. Tom is, but um, I definitely want to uh, see if there's any more little hidden figurines, maybe from like Dune, or uh, well, I'm trying to think back of you know some of the stuff that I used to be into when I was a kid. I don't really remember. The Transformers, though. The Transformers were very, very cool. A lot of remembering of the different things that I had, but um, yeah, hope you enjoy that. Thanks. everyone that was Puma Puna why do I keep messing up your name I called you pwned one time I called you Puna you know what's next you know what's next right what's that tuna yeah. <laughs> it's I've been called many many things I'm gonna call you tuna next tuna tuna is actually a good one from school why don't, why don't people have Kelly why don't have people have, they have names like Kelly Kelly I can't I screw up know. Kelly Kelly you, know you would be a complete so idiot hard. if you screwed up Kelly Kelly yeah. 
Well, she's she's a Hawaiian too, so she oh, dog? she knows. Actually, have you ever, you've heard my full name, right? Uh, you told me one time. My my long long full name. Do it. Punahele kuke kalani kahoili moku. Tannehill. Yeah, I had a very proud father. That is ridiculous. Very proud. Wow. Very very proud father. Like two sentences long. Thirty one thirty one letters, sixteen syllables. 31 what, letters? What's the Hawaiian fish I think it's 31. Name? That's, you oh, reali- you the, realize that's more than the alphabet. Well, it's definitely more than the Hawaiian alphabet. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. What's uh, the Hawaiian fish's name? Uh, Humahuma Nuka Nuka Apua'a. 